Hi there, fix that car here with an episode on how to replace front wishbones or lower arm front suspension. Closer inspection of the wishbone reveals a worn rear bush. Now I think my pointy thing there can just show you the where the rubber started to pull away from the outer ring of the, the bush. This bush hasn't failed, but it's, uh, it's well on its way and needs to be replaced. Before removing any nuts on the front suspension, clean off the threads with a wire brush. It's this rust in these threads that will prevent the uh, bolts coming off cleanly. Then apply a drop of oil to each each thread. The lower clamp bolt will be a problem. Once you've removed the nut, it'll probably be rusted in place. And the way to remove it is with a drift and hammer. I've oiled it, I've loosened it as much as I can with the socket, and I'm now just tapping it through like that. And out it comes. You can see why it resisted so much. There's an awful lot of rust along its shank. To separate this lower joint, use plenty of oil, soak the whole thing in oil, tap a screwdriver into the split at the back, and then use a crowbar to le lever the joint. Back into the screwdriver. And it'll lift away. If you're just removing the wishbone, there's obviously no need to take out the wheel arch liner. And this is held in place with two further bolts. There's a, a large bolt at the back there, going through a horizontal bush. And there's another large bolt at the back here, going through a vertical bush. They both need to be removed, high torque. The uh, drive shaft needs to be supported. I've used a cable tie there to hold it onto the suspension strut. It can then be maneuvered outwards. In our case here, this uh, this joint is worn out at this particular point. The lower wishbone can be taken out by leaving the hub in place, but it will be difficult as this particular bush will be un under tension. The suspension is fully lowered and this bush here will be will be twisted. It'll come out, but there'll be a fight to get it back in place. You'll have to uh, be fighting against this bush to get the, the bolt in. So it is much easier to, to remove the hub if you, if you possibly can do so. Front suspension reassembly, drive shaft, hub, drop link, and wishbone. First thing is the wishbone. Brand new, so what's in the bag? This one seems to be double wrapped, a bag within a bag. So that's what we have. Pretty good comparison to the the one that's come out. Got uh, two bolts essentially that hold this in place. So we get under the wing of the car. Let's lock this in place. long bolt first. With these bolts the nut end always goes towards the back. That's in case a bolt drops out. And then one at the back fits up. Through that hole. Poking out I think you can just about see at the top there. We now tighten these up. That one is fully tightened. This one is left, lo left loose and will need to be tightened when the car's on level ground. If it was to be tightened now, it, it wouldn't be in the normal right position of the, the car and that bush would be strained. So the bottom bolt goes through from the front. It may just need a little bit of persuasion just to push the joint home properly. Here it goes. A little bit of pressure on there, it's just enough to lift it and take it in. That can now be released. 
it's going to be released and that tightened up. 